Radio Master have recently launched two brand new products. This dedicated Express LRS firmware flasher and a True Diversity ELRS receiver that's Gemini mode compatible. And by my calculations, that means Radio Master have launched at least 10 new products this year, which is mighty impressive. Hello, and welcome to the Worldly Bloke channel. There's a couple of ways to flash your Express LRS receivers. Wi-Fi, which is my personal favorite because it's really easy, or you can wire up a receiver to your flight controller and use it along with the Betaflight configurator to act as a sort of pass-through system and flash the receiver using a USB cable plugged into your flight controller. But if you're not using a flight controller, or as sometimes happens, a receiver just doesn't want to play properly and absolutely refuses to flash using Wi-Fi, how are you going to flash it? Well, this Radio Master ELRS USB flasher dongle is the answer. You just plug this into your computer and select it with the Express LRS configurator and connect it to your receiver and off you go. And Radio Master provide a set of connectors so you can easily attach your receiver. There's some test prongs so you can just push this onto your receiver like that. It doesn't matter whether they're soldered or not. And probably more usefully, there's these test probe hooks that you're probably familiar with. These just plug into here, that way around, like that. Uh, you plug that into your computer and then you can just clip these onto your receiver and you're ready to go hands-free. You're not going to need this very often, but when you need it, you'll absolutely need it. And this only costs $10. There's also a switch on the side, so you can select 3.3 or 5 volts, which is a neat touch. And you can also use this connector. I forget what it's called, actually. It's a type of JST connector, if you've got one of those on your receiver. So they've got a complete complement of connection cables, which is very well thought out. Next, we've got this RP4 TD True Diversity ELRS receiver that has two completely separate RF and amplifier circuits that you can see on here. It's 2.4 gigahertz with two times 100 milliwatt RF telemetry power, so that's 200 milliwatts in total. And Radio Master have focused on improving signal to noise ratio and reliability with this. It's got dual temperature compensated crystal oscillators, which improve stability and accuracy, especially in extreme temperatures. So it's perfect for flying in the UK at the moment. They've also improved these dual antennas to make them more rigid and durable, which is a nice feature. And I've talked about ELRS Gemini mode in previous videos, and this is Gemini compatible. Obviously, you'd need a Gemini mode transmitter, and other than homegrown solutions, the only other one that I've used is from Beta FPV. And let's hope 2024 brings some Gemini mode external transmitter modules from Radio Master. Price on this is $24.99 direct from the Radio Master website, and links are in the description below. Now, Radio Master have had a very strong 2023. They've released a lot of very good quality and innovative products that are always at a sensible price, and I've reviewed and used everything that they've released this year. So do check out my other videos to see what I thought of them. And when you get an ELRS receiver that flatly refuses to be flashed, this is your get out of jail free card. It's only $10, and although you're unlikely to be using it regularly, it's worth its weight in gold for those emergencies. And this RP4 True Diversity receiver is a great product, and I'm particularly excited that it's ELRS Gemini mode compatible. 
I've said this before, but I predict that 2024 will be the year of Gemini mode because it adds so much more reliability and stability, particularly for long range and cine lifters with expensive payloads. Both these are available direct on the Radio Master website and I've put links in the description so that you can check out the latest prices and availability. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe for more stuff like this and my other Whirly Bloke projects. And if you're already subscribed, thanks a lot and give this a thumbs up if you found it useful. And if you didn't like it, just click the thumbs up button three times. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.